Hi, today I'm going to show you how you can add international shipping on your Squarespace website. Now, from here, you want to go from the Squarespace dashboard here of your site that you want to add international shipping to. Once here, you want to go on the left hand side here to the scroll bar and you want to scroll down and you want to click on the gear icon here to click to go to the settings. Click on that. Now from here, you want to go to the selling option of the settings. Just click on that. Now from here, you want to scroll down and you want to find the shipping uh, option. There is also a local delivery option, but we want to do a international option. So we're just going to do normal shipping. Just click on shipping. And as you can see, when you click on it, it'll uh, open up a tab like this. There's a lot that you need to set up, so let's get right into it. First off, we need to add a shipping option. Click on Add Shipping Option, and then you will have to uh, pick if it's a flat rate or a weight base rate. So if it's a flat rate, no matter what things they buy, the shipping will always cost the same. So if, we, for, if for example, you sell a, you're a hardware store, it will cost the same to sell uh, to ship a 3 gram cable and it will cost the same to ship a 43 inch TV. So when you uh, pick flat rate, make sure that it makes sense based on your store because shipping a 43 inch TV will of course be more expensive than shipping a cable, right? And there's also weight paste. So the heavier it is, the more it will cost to ship. For this example, let's try flat rate. Click on flat rate. Now you can enter in your details. Uh, I'm going to name it John Doe. And the shipping rate will be about 10,000. And here it is. This is the international part. You need to add the country that this uh, region will ship to. So of course, you can do rest of the world. So that means it will ship to everywhere. It won't have any limitation and it'll just ship everywhere. If you want to only add to ship to certain places, of course, just click on this and then uh, pick the, the country you want to uh, ship to. For this example only though, I'm going to do rest of the world. I'm going to click on save. And now we have a international shipping option made here. I'm going to do another example here, but this time it'll be weight base. So click on weight base and this shipping name will be also be Chonto, but weight. There you go. And now, as you can see for the weight base one, it's a different kind of uh, menu. So in here, it's defined by pounds. So for example, if it's one pound, I'll give you free shipping. But if it's 10 pounds, then you'll start have to be you'll start have to pay money for in the shipping, and if it's a hundred pounds, then you have to pay for full price shipping. There you go, something like that. And of course, there's also orders over one hundred pounds. So if it's over a thousand pounds here, then they'll have to pay a lot. So two hundred or something like that. And again, this is the same as before. Uh, the rest of the country or the rest of the world or just a specific country you want to ship to. For this example, I'm just going to ship this to France and I'm going to click on save. And now we have two kinds of international shipping set up.